right, everyone. Heidi ho, my neighbors and fellow Oklahoma Sooner fans. My name is Harry James Taylor. And I'd like you to thank you, first of all, for watching the preview show for this week in women's hoops for college basketball. The Sooners are going to try to bounce back after a hard loss to West Virginia. And they'll start tomorrow night on the road at Iowa State before heading home for TCU. First of all, the home uh, on Saturday. First of all, the home game against Iowa State will be Oklahoma at Iowa State. The Cyclones of 2012-2013 were 24 and 9. They lost in the second round of the NC2A tournament. On the women's side, 65 to 60 to the University of Georgia. They are head coached by Bill Finley, who's in his 19th year at Iowa State with career wins. Number 162 wins, 235 losses, average and winning percentage of .705. He has also been the head coach at Toledo for one year. The reigning leading returning scorers for Iowa State are as follows. Haley Christofferson, number five for Iowa State. And number four, Nikki Moody. First of all, number five, Haley Christofferson. She averages 15.61 points per ball game last year for Iowa State with 1.33 assists per ball game and 6.70 rebounds per ball game last year for the Cyclones. While Nikki Moody averaged Number four, Nikki Moody, I should say, averaged 8.41 points per ball game, 7.44 assists per ball game, and 3.72 rebounds per ball game last year for Iowa State. On our side of the map, the Sooner Boomers of Oklahoma of 2012-2013 were 24 and 11, losing in the Sweet 16, 74 to 59 to the University of Tennessee. They are head coached once again by Sherry Cole, who is in her 18th year wearing the Crimson and Cream, all at Oklahoma, with career wins at 381 and career losses at 179, winning percentage of .680. Returning leading scorers for the Sooner Boomers, Number three, Ellen, Air, Ellen Air, Ellenberg, and number four, Nicole Griffin, in, numer in numerical order. First of all, number three, Aaron Ellenberg, averaged 18.69 points per ball game last year for the Sooners, while averaging two assists per ball game and 3.34 rebounds per ball game last year for Oklahoma. While Nicole Griffin, Nikki Griffin, number four, she averaged 11.26 points per ball game. 0.91 assists per ball game, and 4.89 rebounds per ball game last year for the revamped centers of OU. The next game is a home game versus the TCU Horn Frogs. The Horn Frogs from 2012 and 2013 finished at 9 and 21 last year, losing in the first round of the Big 12 tourney, 83 to 61 to Kansas. Jeff Mitty is their coach in his 15th year at Texas Christian with career wins and losses at 463 wins to 220 losses, averaging winning percentage of .665. He has also been the head coach at Western Missouri State from 62 from uh, 92 to 95, Arkansas State to 95 to 90, 9, and then now TCU from 99 to present. The leading returning scorers for each side are as follows for TCU at least. Number 14, Zon Medley, and number 4, Natalie Vetris. First, Vonna Medley, she averaged 12.93 points per ballgame last year for 
the Horned Frogs, 4.43 rebounds last year and 2.83 rebounds per ball game last year for TCU. Well, the Purple and Gray also had Natalie Ventress, Ventress number four for TCU, averaging 11.40 points per ball game, 1.00 assists per ball game, and 4.47 rebounds per ball game last year for O for good old TCU. And as far as Oklahoma is concerned, the Sooners went 20 and, of 2012-2013 went 24 and 11 last year for Oklahoma. With a losing, with losing after uh, they did lose that 11th game came and they lost to Tennessee in the Sweet 16, 74. 59, Tennessee. Sherry Coley is the head coach. She's in her 18th year at the helm of OU. With career wins and losses at 381 wins to 179 losses. Winning percentage at .680. All at Oklahoma for the past 18 years. Leading returning scores for Oklahoma. Number 20, number, number, th number three, Aaron, El El Aaron Ellenberg. And number four, Nicole Griffin. First of all, for Nicole, for Aaron Ellenberg, number three, Ellen, Aaron, Aaron Ellenberg, she averaged 18.69 points per ball game last year for the Sooners, while averaging two assists per ball game and 3.34 rebounds per ball game last year for the Sooners. While Nicole Griffin, number four, she averaged 11.26 points per ball game, 0 0.91 assists per ball game and 4.89 rebounds per ball game last year for the Sooners. All right, before we go, that was a two-game preset. Now, take a look here, boys. How proud of you guys are this? <laughs> How proud of you? Well, here's what you need to do. Next Saturday, OU women, show how thankful you are for these. And this. And most importantly, the win over Alabama. You got you the ladies fans, and you too can thank the defensive specialists, Eric, uh, Aaron, uh, Aaron Colvin, Eric Stryker, Stryker, uh, uh, Alexander, the the freshman from Tulsa, all the defensive players, including. Michael Bamani Honey, the Honey Cut, and Company, the special teamers. You could do that next Saturday against Oklahoma State University. The women game, the women's game, the preset. Doors will open an hour and a half before tip, and uh, it'll be up in the upper concourse, as you guys know. Uh, you can meet the defensive specialists and the special team specialists for the defending Sugar Bowl champion, Oklahoma Sooners. And I encourage you all to do so. Uh, it's not that hard either. You can get your tickets. All you got to do, pick up this baby right here. It's, 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 it's your phone. 1-800-456-GO-OU or get onto your ticket. Uh, space there on Soonersports.com and click on tickets. And I encourage you, because Oklahoma State is not a bad team this year. They are not a bad team. And plus, this is more than you, you get to meet the football team. So I encourage you to do that ASAP. ASAP. Hopefully I'll see you guys next Saturday. But this Saturday, don't forget, they have a game with TCU. But before even that happens, they'll have a game tomorrow night on Fox Sports 1 against Iowa State. Thanks for watching the pregame show, everyone. And as always, Boomer Sooner. Thanks for every watching, everyone. Stay tuned. Oh, by the way, don't forget, follow me on Twitter, at SoonerFanOK, or you can follow me on Facebook, Harry James Taylor. Thanks for, it. Thanks for watching, everyone. And as always, Boomer Sooner, keep it real, boys and girls.